your crop is under threat. Do you know the output price for your cotton can go down drastically? The reason for all this? It's the pink ballworm. Yes, it's the pink ballworm that can seriously damage your cotton crop, thus impacting your lives. Pink ballworm belongs to the Lepidopteran family, which has been infecting cotton since many years. Let's understand the life cycle of pink ballworm and how it infests cotton crop. Pink ballworm lays its eggs singly or in groups of four to five under the bracteoles, squares, leaves or other parts of plant. The larvae hatches from the egg and infects the flower bud or young balls. The larva in the flower bud spins a web, preventing proper flower opening, leading to rosetted bloom. Larvae feed on the developing seeds and in the case of younger bowls, entire content gets destroyed. Several larvae can infest one single bowl. Usual symptoms of pink ballworm infestation include rosetted flowers and small exit holes, ultimately leading to improper ball opening and damaged lint. Now what needs to be done to stop this pink ballworm menace? First, we need to understand the crop dynamics and the challenges to manage pink ballworm effectively. Flowering in cotton is not synchronized and the crop keeps flowering throughout its reproductive stage. The first flush of flowering contributes approximately 40 to 50 percent of the total yield and the remaining 50 to 60 percent is contributed by the sequential flowering between 70 to 100 days after sowing which makes pink ballworm management very difficult. Let us get ready for a war on pink ballworm. How do we manage pink ballworm? How do we kill it? Integrated pest management is the only way to effectively manage pink ballworm. Complete destruction of leftover balls, planting of refugee seeds, deep plowing during summer months, monitoring of infestation through pheromone traps, use of Ampligo at 45 and 55 days after sowing. Ampligo the most potent product for the management of pink ballworm. Ampligo destroys both eggs and larvae with its unique combination, thus reducing the pink ballworm population. Usage of Ampligo at the recommended time of 45 and 55 days after sowing is very critical. 45 and 55 days after sowing ensures protection of the first flush, which contributes to approximately 50% of the yield. For effective coverage, use 100 ml of Ampligo per acre in 200 liters water. Ampligo kills both eggs and larva. Protection of first flush of cotton, thus protecting 40 to 50% of the yield. Long duration control and no need to use multiple rounds of generic insecticides 